What actually happened to Abraham Lincoln on that fateful day? In 1865 at Ford's Theater in Washington, D.C., a tragic event unfolded that would change the course of American history forever. President Abraham Lincoln was seated in the presidential box with his wife Mary Todd Lincoln. They're enjoying the performance of our American cousin. It was April 14th, a night filled with laughter and entertainment. But amidst the merriment, a sinister plot was underway. A figure emerges from the shadows. John Wilkes Booth, a Confederate sympathizer and actor, stealthily approaches the presidential box. He takes aim at President Lincoln and fires. Chaos erupts as the audience realizes what has happened. Mary Todd Lincoln screams in horror, while Lincoln slumps forward, mortally wounded. Booth leaps from the box onto the stage, shouting his infamous words, Six Semper Tyrannies, and manages to escape into the night, as security was unable to apprehend him, leaving behind a nation in shock and mourning.